Hello everyone and welcome back to another Minecraft video. Today we have a tutorial for you on how to build a forklift. Now anyone watching my SMP series on my channel will know that I have recently had to build forklifts and other kinds of trucks and vehicles for my industrial district. So that is where the inspiration for the video has come from. So let's get into it. So I prepared a list of materials that you will need. So and here is all the different types of materials that you will need. It's not got the exact numbers of things, but these are the materials themselves. So we'll grab these ones, as these are the main structure blocks for the build. So first of all, we want uh, two coal blocks like that, as these will represent the two front wheels. And another one at the back, as forklifts sometimes have just one singular wheel at the back. And then we take the full red sandstone block, and then we take the slabs, like so. A stair like that. A stair like that. So we have something that looks like that. Take another slab, like that. And that. <laughs> so we come to the back. We do an upside down and a side stair, like that. And a full block in the middle. And that has got our main structure for the forklift done. Now we take our quartz stair and I actually probably want just a block like that so we can place the stair on top. Yep, just like that. Alright, and that is our main structure for the forklift body itself. Now we take our andesite wall. We start here and we go after that we go one, two, three and four. One, two, oops, two, three and four. Right, then we come across like that and come down to the bottom and on the top section of this coal block we put some iron trapdoors and we come out another one, two, three. So there's four in total. One, two, three. And there we have our arms for the forklift. So first thing we will do is create the cabin for the driver. So we just do dark oak and fences around the corners like so. Then we come up the top and take spruce trapdoors like so. Boop, boop, boop. Like that. And I like to just make them all face the same way. So there we go. That's a little cabin done for the driver. Then we take our acacia trapdoor and we can just do that for a little backing of the chair. So next up a nice little detail I thought looked good on this build was actually putting a grindstone up the top and then putting in some more dark oak fence and that just looks like the pulley system for the actual mechanism that moves the forklift up and down. And at the top here a couple of little flower pots just look like the maybe the warning lights that you get on industrial type um, vehicles uh, when it's in operation. Alright, we're nearly done now and we just add a couple of buttons to the side, dark oak buttons to match the rest. We add some stone buttons like here and here, just around the tyres. Then we come to the back and we want to add two item frames on either side and a trip wire hook in the middle. Uh, we then take our redstone block and place it in the item frames as the brake lights. And that is pretty much it for the structure. It is all done now. We have a forklift. It looks pretty cool. It's pretty small, as forklifts normally are. So that's quite good when we have it scale next to other trucks and things. What we can do is, if you wanted it to be carrying an empty pallet, we can actually use the campfires. So if you just take some campfires like this and actually just extinguish them, that just looks like a nice pallet, uh, an empty pallet that it is carrying. Again, this part is optional. And then you could actually add, I mean, it's up to you really at this point, but you could add barrels, you could add anything here. What looks quite good, actually, is the loom um, as a kind of empty storage container. And there we go. Looks like it's carrying some, um, some storage, some boxes. Fits in with the factory theme. Right guys, that is going to do it again, it's just a short little video, nothing too complicated, but I hope that has inspired someone and maybe give someone a helping hand on building a forklift truck in their world. If you liked the video, 
then please leave a like and a comment with any suggestions of any other vehicle builds, anything that I have built on my SMP series, some trucks or cars, I'd be happy to make a small tutorial on those as well. But I hope you enjoyed, until next time, bye bye.